I'm Sandy with Sandy's Vintage Home Decor and Treasures. I'm going to try to get some of this other, the rest of this box. I watched my last video and I don't know why this camera just cuts me off. It's my phone camera and so it's so irritating because I can't, I don't know. Usually it's 35 minutes, but then it cuts me off. I don't know, but I'm going today to hopefully get a, a, a GoPro. So Anyway, I'm going to jump into this. Behind me is my uh, cabinet, one of the cabinets that I'm finishing. I've got to put the knobs on it and finish distressing the sides of it, taking that to the booth today or tomorrow. So anyway, let's jump into this. Let me move my drink so I don't knock it off. I'm sitting on the floor again just because this box is so heavy. All right, this is another... Seven for All Mankind. It's a skinny high waist. And it, here's the, here's that. And these look really, really good. I don't see any kind of distressing. Let me see. Um, no type, well, a little puckering right here. But the thing of it is, is that um, you're going to have the puckering no matter what. Um, yes, some of the elastic, it has broken in there, but all, you can note it, but when people wear it, it stretches it back out, so it's not noticeable. I will note it in my listing, but see, I just put my hand in there, and it just comes right out. So, anyway, I will wash and dry them, too, and that sometimes helps that elastic just shrink back and get in, get back the pull of it, the pull of it. Here's some really cute, these are intentional, G, um, shorts, they are BDG, and I don't see a size in it, and I don't even see a size, a place where the size will be, but I think these, these they have the button fly, so those would be really good, I'll just measure that and just tell them, it's probably about a 27, so a small. Maybe a 28. All right. Now we have uh, American Eagle Distressed Jeans. And once again, these have the patches like I talked about in the last video. Um, distressing on there. And here's the back. So these are a super stretch. And they are a size 6. Skinny. So yeah, these are these would would be able. I'll I'll list those. I'll just have. To, oh, my last box. I kind of looked up before I threw everything already from that first haul. Threw it in the wash washer. Now they're in the dryer, um, and some of those were, were really good finds. So um, I had just kind of glanced through them as I was sorting them out. Did some comps on them in Google and everything. So yeah, I'm I'm glad. Okay, this is a small Max Jeans. It's a shirt, a chambray shirt, dark chambray. You can roll the pockets or the pockets. You can roll the pockets up if you want to, but, you know, I usually roll the sleeves up. But <laughs> they have the tab where the, the button on the, the, the uh, sleeves, you can roll them up and, and cuff them. That's cute, and I don't see any kind of flaws on it unless some of the buttons are missing. And, nope, none of the buttons are missing. Okay, so here we have um, Lucky Brand, size 31. So, let's look at it. Let's examine it. has a little bit of wear on the bottom. I can... I can disclose that, but honestly, these look really good for, and they have the Lucky Brand, has the pockets that have the four-leaf clover, so I will probably list those. It's the straight, straight leg, so yeah. Another pair of shorts, it's called, oh, J. Crew Indigo Denim, and size 25. Um, it has has a little bit distressing there so I'll look those up and see uh, maybe add some more distressing to it maybe 
I don't know. They're cute. They've sewn it so the distressing won't go any further. All right. Here is a pair of um, knee shorts, Bermuda shorts. It's by Bermuda. Um, it's a size 7. And here is the logo for it. So these are very nice. So I will definitely sell these. I think that those will be real good for the summer. Another pair of shorts from Michael Kors. Let's see if I can find the size. Size two. Cut off jeans. And they are once again sewn so there could be no more but I will look Michael Kors up. It's not Michael Michael Kors. It's Michael Kors. I have another. I got in um, another. If I I can't remember where I found it at, but um, I got it and it's Michael Michael Kors, which is not as good as Michael Kors. I don't know about people's names. It's like you know what? Just do one one name, one brand. Let's stick with it, and. Let's get stuff that people can pronounce, you know, instead of all this. Okay, here is a distressed jean jacket. This is so cute. Look at this. It's distressed in the front, and it's distressed on the back. And that is so cool. Oh, gosh. Now, see, look. The, the brand's been cut out size has been cut out but I will measure this because I think I think it'll sell I will wash it up I think it definitely will sell um, unbranded because it's so distressed and it's a jean jacket okay this one here is blue spice I don't know I've never heard of blue spice I'll have to look it up size three here's the, the and it's a pair of cutoffs and so I don't know about these. These, if I don't, if I don't find anything on these, I will just take these and make it a purse. And that way, um, it'd be a kind of a smaller purse. Okay, here is a pair of pink. Uh, let's see. They are wanna wanna bed a butt. Size seven twenty eight. So if you want a better butt, I guess you better buy these jeans because if you don't buy these jeans, you don't get a better butt. You know what I'm saying? Um, I cuffed at the, I'll steam these before I, before I take pictures of it, but I'm going to wash them first. They are distressed there and on the other side here. Um, there. And... I like them. I like I like pink. I think these would be really cute. Um, so yeah, I'll look those up. Okay, here we go. This is a Next Level Flex. That was one of those other ones, and I looked it up, and they do hold their resale value pretty well. I mean, you're not going to make a hundred bucks off usually anything in these boxes, but you can get some decent money. I think these were going for like thirty dollars. Um, I looked on Poshmark. They were going anywhere from forty to thirty to forty dollars. So, um, yeah, eBay as well. You know, so I mean, that's they do retail for quite a bit more than that. But for me, it's like if you do a resale, then you're either cutting your your um, retail price in half, or at least by two thirds. It's going to be lower, absolutely. So that's why we are resellers. <laughs> so even if you do $25 to $30, it doesn't sound like a whole bunch. But the thing of it is, is that if you sell for at $25, you've made already $100. So, you know, it's like that basically pays for the box. Over, over pays for the box. Way over. So, you know, you can get those and you know if you do sell it you, you've already made a profit and then after that you definitely made a profit when you pay sell the four dollar four 
jeans and you'll definitely make all profit after that so anyway this is this is at let me see size is okay this is a man's 26 28 and American Eagle does put out that this brand here I don't know can you see it so um, these are tight fit has distressing on the knees so yep I will look that up okay let's see okay now we have a kids Oh, seven for all mankind. It's an ankle skinny, and this looks like a six, a six. So those are really, really nice. So I will definitely put these up. I know you don't get a whole lot for um, kids' jeans, but you know if you put them, you know, ten to fifteen dollars. That's really a savings for parents who instead of buying brand new ones. And I'm watching my time because I don't want this to be cut off again. Oh, my Lord. Look at that. Isn't those adorable? Oh, we have some. Look, we have some distressing on the knees. Apparently, they were pretty rough with them. <laughs> so, it looks like the distressing is supposed to be there. It's a Oshkosh Bagosh. Yep. Skinny boot cut. Oh, my gosh. Let's put your boots on. <laughs> it's a 12 months. I love it. Those. I man my kids were this little actually my twins were actually smaller i have a twin so they're my oldest i had them when i was 20. so um they're my oldest and then i have and they were boys i have another son and then i have a daughter and then i have 11 grandchildren you know what though and <laughs> this is just on the subject of being a, a nana um and i'm going to do it as i'm doing talking to you um, these here are, it looks like a Route 66, and they are an 18 month, no, 18, size 18, is that a size 18, must be, oh, it's a 15, kid size, so that would probably be, probably about a 7, size 7, but anyway, Talking about being a Nana, I have 11 grandchildren, and I love each one of them. Oh, my gosh. They, they, these are Cherokee Walmart brand, size 8. So, these are nice. Um, however, the resale value, they're Walmart brand. I'll make a purse out of that. So, I'm going to throw those over in my purse pile. Um, anyway, people get these grandma sweaters or grandma this or grandma that. It's like... Okay, yeah, they're sometimes older women, but you're talking about maybe great-grandma, you know, <laughs> would wear the things that they say, these are grandma sweaters. I'm a grandma, and actually I'm a nana. Everybody calls me nana. And I am a young nana. I, I, um, I was in my early 40s when I became a nana for the first time, and I loved it to pieces. And it was a boy, and he was my light and sunshine and everything else he captured my heart but um anyway i don't i don't wear those clothes that people when they say this is grandma sweater i don't wear those clothes because you know i'm not that old okay this is bke denim jake bootleg and it's a size 33 regular these are pretty beat up I mean, you're talking about dis distressed, big time. Um, I'm not sure. Let me look at the. I'm not sure if that is. Uh, these are really, really beat up. Could I? Um, I'll wash them and see what they look like yet after coming out of the wash where they're out of the dryer. But these just might go into my purse pile. I'm keeping an eye on that phone there. Okay, this is a Levi 550 Relaxed. And it is a size 10 regular. So it's a, a kid's 10 regular. And they look pretty good. There's no, um, yeah, those look good. 
let's see. Here's another pair. Um, it's a Gap 1969. It's a size 24 curvy. So this is a low rise. Um, kind of has the flare leg that comes out. Not not big, Tommy. It looks like a skinny leg down and it flares out the, the end of the at the end of the leg. Um, I'm trying to look at the front to see what it looks like. Those don't look too bad. So those may be in the running. All right. Another, oh, this is a vest. This is, is a uh, Abercrombie and Fitch original denim. Um, so it's a vest. And let's see if the buttons are there. This is a woman's. And okay, they look okay. Yep. All right, Abercrombie and Fitch uh, went out of business. Uh, American Eagle. These are the next level air, air flex. Air flex. And it is a size 2630, so it's a man's 2630. Um, and they are skinny jeans. So those are good. And these, however, doesn't, they are Hollister Waist 27. It's a five regular. So has the American Eagle there brand here. I think that's one of their older brands. I'm sorry. It's Hollister, not American Eagle. It's Hollister. And there you go. Hollister. Um, has no hem, has, has the, uh, distressing on the fraying on the, um, I'll have to look these up and see what I want to do with them. And here we have uh, Kenneth Cole, New York, size 8. And they are have distressing on the leg. Both legs have distressing. And so, yeah, I'll look those up. I don't. I have heard of Kenneth Cole, but I have never seen them or looked at comps up on them. Okay, this is a kids. I wish they wouldn't have got me so many kids because I mean I don't know how kids sell on here. It's a Levi 505 regular. It's a 10 regular. So has the Levi little leather patch back there. I'm not excited about so many kids jeans just because it's like, I don't know. If, maybe if I was into selling kids clothes, that'd be better. Okay, this is a C of H. Los Angeles. And it is a size 26. It looks like this is some of those waxed ones. And I... When I was looking up comps on the on some of them, it came up as waxed. There's some pretty good comps on it, so I will definitely look up this. Um, oh, citizen citizens of humanity by Jerome Damon. Damon. Um, so yeah, I'm going to look up comps on this and see about it. They look really in good condition. And yeah, they're the waxed ones. We're almost done. Hopefully we can have, we're 19 minutes in. American Eagle Outfitters. This is the Ex Extreme Flex. And it has the little tab on the back. Straight leg. So yep, those will, okay, here's a pair of white ones. We have... J brand, we had J brand before, that was a pretty good, um, and this is a size 26, and I will look at these, they are distressed on the knees, but I will look at these over 
just to make sure there's no stains or spots since they are white. And here we have Liverpool of Los Angeles. It's a two, waist 26. It's a Capri, so, well, it doesn't look like it's Capri. Maybe it is, but, um, yeah, these look okay. Uh, okay, here, oh, these are cute. We have Indigo Rain Forever, size 3. These are pretty. So, I will look the comps up for those, because that they look really good. Okay. Here we have the a page, 28. And... These look pretty good. They are skinny. Um, Calvin Klein, 27. And these look a little bit dingy, so I may keep those to make out of a purse. They just look, yeah, there's a lot of stretching. Now, this kind of stretching, it usually doesn't go away. See how that put is so puckered? So I will check that out. I'm going to try to, 21, okay, I'm going to look and see for the better ones on here. Um, these are Universal Standard, size 12, and they look to be um, skinny. Okay, these are True Time, Walmart brand, size 8. I don't know about that, so I'll look those up. I got a sock didn't know we got socks and jeans um this here is a silver jeans sliver silver jeans zach i guess that's the the kind and it's a 32 waist length 30 so these must be men's so they look pretty good and um we have American Outfitters Super Stretch, and I don't know about those. Once I wash them, oh, here's the other sock. Oh, nope, I left it in there. Um, another jean jacket. This is Lane Bryant, size 18. I wonder if I can wear this. Yeah, I'm not an 18, but if it's, I think I have one. Okay, and... Seven for All Mankind Boot Cut. And these look pretty good. They are the boot cut. Looks good. Okay, this one is Lauren Conrad, size 8. It has some distressing. Now, these look like um, they're short jeans. It has the distressing on the front. And we have a kid's one, and I'll probably not sell that. It's a Circo 3T. I don't know. I'll look and see. kind of looks... Okay, and here is... This one is the same thing. Oh, this is Jumping Beans 3T. So I'll have to just look up comps on those. And that is it. We have finished the box. So I thank everybody for having this. If you didn't see the first video, be sure to go back and see it. And um, this is the second of the 50-pound box. And I'm, I'm really pleased with the, you know, I, I know what I'm going to do. I kind of got these for the three reasons. Um, but I wish I didn't get so many smalls. And I think everybody says that. So I'm sure because, you know, I'm not, I've had kids. So, you know, I've got, and so I um, am... Kind of disappointed that I got a lot of smalls, but it looks like everybody gets small because they probably don't sell as fast as a uh, woman's larger sizes. And so that is why they put so many smalls in all of these, even, even the regular clothes, the mixture of clothes. So anyway, well, I thank everybody for watching and... Stay tuned for more. Watch out for my videos. I'll be coming out with more. Um, anyway, I gotta get busy. I gotta finish this. I've got some 
I'm washing clothes, these clothes. I've got to make, sew some oven towels. So it's a busy day. So I will talk to you all later. I'm glad you spent the last 25 minutes with me. And you all take care and have a good Saturday. All right. And watch for more videos. Sandy at Sandy's Vintage Home Decor and Treasures. I will link everything in my, like my eBay shop, my Poshmark shop, my email. I'll list it in the description. And you guys take care and have a good one.